Hey, nerdlings. What up, nerdlings? Hey, do you nerd for trying new things? They're doing things they've never done, hoping that it's lots of fun. Oh, oh, oh they're nerdgins. It's a nerdgin thing! <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> You know, something that we like to do is taste test stuff, whether it's food or drinks or, you know, with gaming off the grid beers. Uh, this time around, we're keeping it a little softer and just trying out some sodas. A soft drink. <laughs> ah, there we go. <laughs> so uh, we've got all Coca-Cola products, three different kinds of Coke and one Sprite. Yes. And... Uh, in the bottles, we have a California raspberry and a Georgia peach, and I don't know what to think about these because uh, mixing fruit flavors with Coke seems weird. I feel weird. like the raspberry is going to be good. I, To me, for some reason, I keep thinking that it's going to be like a chocolate raspberry kind of flavor. Peach, I'm a little worried about. Well, let's start with the raspberry then, since you have a good feeling about that. Right now, I'm just getting a uh, kind of a... Like a vanilla smell almost. I, you know, like I'm just smooth. getting a uh, very sugary, sweet Coca-Cola, kind of like uh, Diet Coke. I'm just happy that they're in the glass bottles. Everything tastes better in a glass bottle. We'll do just a little in the glass so you can kind of see it in there. It doesn't look like there's really any change in the color. I don't know if I'm just looking at the glass weird, but uh, for a second it almost looked like maybe there was a uh, pinkish hue to it. Maybe. So bottle or glass? I'll go for bottle. All right. Okay. Kind of like a chocolate raspberry flavor. So first of all, I got a lot more of that smell, the raspberry smell, as I went to take a drink. And uh, it kind of put me off at first. But yes, it is, it is very much like a chocolate raspberry, raspberry flavor. Um, it's good though. I like it. So yeah, kind of a... I don't uh, think I could drink it all the time. No. But it's no, good. Definitely. It's a different change. So very much um, more of a chocolate raspberry carbonated flavor, <laughs> I think. But yeah, it's it's not as bad as I expected. You don't like peach, do you? I do not. So I'm very curious, and I know you've been kind of worried to try the peach one. A little bit. <laughs> Again, other than cherry, I don't really need fruity flavors mixed with my Coca-Cola. I didn't think I needed vanilla in my Coke until I tried vanilla Coke and then was totally sold on it. Well, again, I'm not getting much of a smell oh out of gosh. the bottle. You're not? I'm not. I get nothing, but it's like it, it smells like those peach gummy rings to me. There's so much peach in that. See, I didn't smell anything in the other one, so that's kind of funny. That is weird. Bottle again? A bottle again. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Palette cleanser. Is it a good vintage? Wow. It's like a carbonated peach ring. Peach gummy ring. Well, to be fair, I don't feel like I'm getting a whole lot of peach flavor, which is weird because I didn't Try get the, the smell. I'm still not getting much of a smell. I get a little bit of a peach, but it's yeah, not Yeah, see, it's not in the glass. Because, see, I could smell it better in the glass. There's the way the neck of the bottle, I think, does something. Yeah, see, not as much peach in the glass. I do get more of a flavor. I'm not getting a whole lot of peach. I'm getting more of a syrup flavor straight from the bottle. But yes, it is a lot more subdued from the glass. Maybe because you don't like peach, you didn't eat a lot of the peach rings as a kid. You like oh, stayed yeah. away from it. And maybe I love those. So I've maybe that flavor is more like Could my be. tongue recognizes it more. Could be. That, that makes, makes a lot of sense. <laughs> So I like that one. That's good. Well, then that one is probably all you. It is funny, though. Um, trying it, the bottle versus the glass, they do have different flavors. And I know people probably think you're crazy when you're like, oh, it tastes better in a bottle. But it does. I think there's something to do with that neck and the way it forces it into a smaller... I don't know. Could be, and... If you're not pouring it into a glass, obviously you're not losing some of that carbonation, yeah. so you're not losing a the air is not getting bite. to it so much. I don't know. There's a difference. All right. So this should be interesting in the fact that it is orange, orange vanilla, vanilla, Coke. and this is just in a plastic bottle as yes. opposed to the glass bottles. 
Because I am having fun realizing that there is a difference between glass and and bottle beverage. Any difference in color there? I am I still don't see it. Maybe no. this is a little lighter. Of course, I'm holding it right up to the lights. <laughs> Not really going to mm. be as much fun of a clink, I don't think. I do get a lot of orange smell from the glass. I get a sweet orange smell. See, not so much there, but I do have notes, sinus issues. All right, well, regardless. Clank. Ding. <laughs> <laughs> Tastes like a dream sickle. Yes. And I don't like exactly. those. Exactly. Um, Which is funny because I love orange flavor. Like, I love getting those chocolate oranges at yes. Christmas time. But this is too vanilla-y. It's too, too orange sickle too, too creamy, yeah. too vanilla, not enough orange. Yeah. Let's see if the glass is any different. There's more of an orange flavor, but still a, a sweet vanilla. I, I do feel like it is coming across a little more sweeter straight from the bottle, which uh, which is interesting because I would expect a little more of a bite from the bottle, mm -hmm. kind of like the glass bottles. But uh, yeah, it is almost a little more mild and a little more sweet straight from the bottle versus the glass. Yeah. And very true. The the uh, orange creamsicle, it's very, or dreamsicle? I think they call them dreamsicles. I probably had the knockoff once. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, an orange sickle, orange cream, ugh, I just never liked this. So yeah, it's it's very much that flavor, just carbonated. Well, so that's kind go. of interesting. I'll drink the peach, you can drink the orange. I, I could probably <laughs> handle that. <laughs> Last, we have a Sprite. Lemonade, and they spelled it all weird. Limonade. Limonade. <laughs> now, this is interesting because actually, in the summertime, there are times when we'll stop into a gas station and go over to the fountain drinks. And I actually do like to uh, take a cup and fill it about like two thirds with lemonade mm -hmm. and then kind of finish it off with Sprite, you know, because I like that refreshing crisp of the lemonade mm -hmm. with just that hint of a bite of the carbonated Sprite. So, I'm hoping this tastes like that because so far I already feel like they stole my idea. It's definitely a different color than normal Sprite. It does have that lemonade <laughs> like like milkiness to it. Lemon, lime, and lemonade flavored soda with real juice. Real juice. It smells good. It smells very lemony. It smells like lemonade. <laughs> we need more lemon pledge. See, it just tastes like a knockoff Sprite to me. It, yeah, it does. Um, <laughs> It doesn't taste lemonadey or spritey. It tastes like we got we went to the store and we couldn't afford Sprite, so we got Sprout. It tastes <laughs> Sprout. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like a knockoff. There's or a weird uh, if you've seen the machines that instead of having the line of fountain drinks, it's just the one, and you press the buttons to pick whichever one you want. It kind of tastes like you got a Sprite out of there, so it's mixed with who knows what, but all you know is it doesn't taste like Sprite, which is what you wanted. Um, Have you ever made poor man's lemonade? <laughs> Where you go to the, the store or the restaurant and you've got your water, you have them bring you a whole bunch of lemons and you squeeze it in there, then you try to pour some sugar in there? No. No? I have not. That's what that tastes like. <laughs> um, it's definitely not as refreshing as I hope. No. Uh, I will probably stick to my own concoction. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is actually a little disappointing. There's not because, that enjoyable bite yeah, from the Sprite. Yeah, I was really hoping I for that. I love Sprite. Sprite is my favorite soda. And I was really hoping for that like bite, but then there's there would just be like that extra like lemony flavor. But all right, well, some interesting flavors right there. Um, Coca-Cola loves to try different things. And we love that you do that because we love trying new things. So, uh, I, can honestly I say guess we're both on the fence with raspberry. You liked this, uh, the peach one. Uh -huh. I didn't mind the orange I one. I did not. And both of us were kind of let down by the limonade Sprite. <laughs> Nerdlings, we would love to know if any of you have tried any of these or if there are some uh, flavors out there that we need to keep an eye out mm -hmm. for or uh, especially our viewers across the pond from us. Yes. What kind of fun flavors do you have? Because uh, maybe if you think about it, pick one up and yeah. share a taste test because we'd like to know what we're missing out. I will say when we uh, visit Las Vegas, we do like to go to the big Coke store there and they do have what they call Cokes of the World. Mm -hmm. And we have got to try some other fun Coke products and 
Some are good and some are very yeah, not some so are good. fun and some are less fun. Anyway, leave some comments down below. Hit a like if you happen to like the video. And uh, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell because we do all kinds of videos, as you see. Yes. It's not always nerdy stuff. Sometimes it's just being nerdy for drinks, I guess. Hey, you know, you're we're doing experiments. It's nerdy. There, there you go. <laughs> Don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter and Instagram for those closer upper pictures to let you know what we're doing out and about in the real world and to let you know that a YouTube video has dropped because sometimes YouTube is kind of mean to you. And also, don't forget to hit us up on TeePublic and get that merch because we want to see you in our clothes. Don't forget, nerdlings, if we like it. We nerd it and drink it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, nerdlings. Here you go, Loki. You want some? It matches. <laughs> nice. It matches. <laughs> Research. Don't forget to hit us up over there on Facebook. Hit the like button on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And, uh, you know, let me try that again. Yeah, would you? Because I just don't know where I was going. Okay. All right. Don't forget to follow us and like us. What is it? I don't really say now. I'm totally flabbergasted.